Ladies and gents, welcome back. Another absolute beautiful day out here. We're getting a nice break from the rain. It's almost 60 degrees. I'm loving it. And uh, yeah, so we're going to get a little bit of stuff done today. Um, first thing on the list of to-dos is we need to finish the PW50. Uh, last video, we were playing around with the tuning. Um, let me show you what we got going on here. So here she is. I got the fuel bottle hooked up to her, and I got it running pretty good. Um, the trick to these, these little things, little two-stroke carbs, this, this adjustment right here, your uh, fuel idle adjustment, run that thing all the way in, bring it out a turn and a half, and then fine tune from there when it gets warm, that helps. The bike runs pretty good, but one of the things I'd like to do is take off the exhaust um, normally there's a plate in here uh, I want to clean this up I think maybe it's getting a little bit restricted um, so we're gonna clean that up a little bit and see if that helps with the rev out also I read online if you unplug a couple of these uh, connectors it like undoes the CDI or whatever where it'll let it rev completely out but we're not gonna do that um, I don't think the, the guy wants that. I'll tell him about it. If he wants to do it, he can. Another thing I'd like to do is uh, look at that carb or uh, look at that spark plug right there. Kind of looks old. We'll pull it, see what it looks like, and um, maybe put a new one in. Off here, there's two 10 millimeter bolts, and they just unscrew like so, and should pop the thing right off. You might have to take the the bigger silencer part off too, but we'll see. Right, pop the exhaust off, and it looks like that uh, that plate isn't isn't present. So somebody's already taken it out. But let's definitely clean this up because it's got a lot of carbon and oil and all that good stuff on it. All right, so I popped off the uh, the screws that hold on the end cap here, and I just wanted to pull this out and see what it looked like and see how dirty and packed all that was look who's here uno come here buddy come here uno uno come here oh he's fine yeah i just don't want him to jump oh. it's no big... how about that we had a nice little visit from grandpa john see nice day out he had to get his bike out it's contagious all right guys i'm gonna try to get in some good light here so you can see it but that is going to be an issue there is barely any anything going on there oh yeah and a giant hole right there so not good on all fronts we need to uh make a better better clamping system there maybe this camera i can get a better view all right i know it's loud but if you look right there you can see bubbles you should not see bubbles right there that is not uh that's not kosher all right, well, I think I got her where, where I like it right now. It idles nice and fine. Revs up good. Yeah, I think it runs, runs pretty good. I guess we should put her back together. All right, guys, I think that this one is finished. Let's, uh, let's check her out. Put her on start. A little kicky action. Oop. There we go. Idle's nice and good. I fixed up the exhaust a little bit with uh, what I had. Awesome throttle response. It even carried my 200 pound self uh, up the driveway and around down the street a little bit. So, yeah, I think that's a wrap on that. All right, guys, the uh, the little PW50, not too bad of a project. Cleaned the carb, adjusted all the cables, everything was really wonky on it. <clears throat> um, cleaned the exhaust out. Excuse me. Um, but, yeah, it's, it's, a, it's a good running little bike now, so... Pretty, pretty easy little project. Hopefully the dude's happy. Um, as always, thanks for tuning in. Don't forget to subscribe if you're new to the channel, and we'll see you tomorrow on the next one.